Just try as much as you can to relax. Doctors across the country are saying that one of the treatments for severe burns is a high protein diet. After someone receives major burns covering, say, 20% or more of their body, nutrition may be the last thing on their mind. This was the case for Troy Patchen, who received second and third degree burns that covered 40% of his body after a work related accident. When I first got here, my appetite was nothing from what it used to be, I guess, from the pain of the injuries and everything. My doctors told me that the feeding tube and stuff like that gives me probably the same equivalent to eating like 15 to 20 Big Macs a day and the protein and everything. Patchen has spent nearly two months recovering from his injuries. Part of his treatment included ingesting a feeding solution containing proteins, vitamin D, omega-3 fatty acids, and other nutrients administered through a feeding tube. According to doctors at Ohio State's Wexner Medical Center, burn patients need to eat about 140% more of their normal calories and four times the protein to fully heal. Otherwise, the body will steal protein from itself. What their body does is it starts basically consuming their own muscle mass and their own um, protein stores in order to deliver that nutrition to heal the wound. We don't want the body to use itself. So increasing the diet, increasing protein in the diet, getting the patients to eat, giving them supplemental feedings is a way of providing them with the proteins and the calories that they need to heal their burn wounds. The doctors hypothesize that the diet should continue for a while once the patient returns home and the wound appears to be healed. The doctors recommend high protein diets even for those who suffer from minor burns for a faster recovery. Reporting for ABC 10 and the CW5, I'm Sarah Mack.